So here is the Shazam app. Uh, I think it was acquired by Apple. And the idea of this app is that you can recognize songs. Uh, if you don't know, for example, you're on a party or some event and you listen to some really beautiful song and you just don't know who the artist is. And it can take you a lot of time to Googling, asking other people who is this artist and what is the song title. So you don't need to do that. There is an app for that, which is called Shazam. So the idea of that is that just start playing the song and then tap on this uh, icon and then uh, it will just start listening. Uh, and then it will be able to recognize the song. The quick trick is that if you long press, you can enable Auto Shazam. So, for example, if you're on some party, you like a lot of songs, you can just enable Auto Shazam and it will recognize all the songs. Uh, and then when the songs are recognized, they're called Shazams here, they're added to your library. So, as you can see here, these are my re recent Shazams. Um, so, that's that. And then uh, I can just click on those, can open it in Spotify, open an Apple Music, buy on iTunes. I can view artists, I can remove from my music. Um, and then also I can see all the artists I shazamed. And then in the bottom, I will see also the playlist created for me and all of that. Uh, so there you have it in the top left gear icon you have all these services like spotify and apple music you can get up to four months free of apple music from this link in shazam app and then you also have spotify so i connected my spotify account to shazam and then i yeah just enabled sync shazams to spotify so how it works is that all, all my Shazam tracks, like all the songs I recognized, will be created in Spotify. All new Shazams will be automatically added, and then I can just manage these songs as usual songs in Spotify, just add them in other playlists and stuff like that. So yeah, in my Spotify, I just have like Shazams, just a separate playlist, and it's super fun. Yeah, also you can enable iCloud Sync, so sync your Shazams uh, across all your devices. You can enable and see notifications here. Uh, location, such as I'm on App Start. You can enable disable video preview. And then that's about it. Um, you can reach out, uh, you can change microphone. Uh, you can reach out to their help. So something like that. Um, what else? So that's basically the app. Uh, then, of course, you can uh, uh, search. So then you can see all the Shazam charts, like top charts, uh, top, the most Shazam tracks in all the countries, all the cities. So it's similar to Apple Music charts or like Spotify charts. So you can find some really cool music here. Um, so that's that and then you can just refresh or close the page so that's really a nice feature overall the app is has super nice design it's very minimalistic you instantly understand how to use it and what to do uh, so yeah I just want don't want to show them a lot of music because obviously I don't have rights for it but I think you just get the idea <clears throat> just tap the Shazam when you're listening to the song and it will recognize it in my experience if the song is well known it will recognize it but if it's some unknown DJ or less known track, there might be difficulties and the app might not be that precise. Uh, so then maybe you just won't recognize it. So it doesn't have like 100% recognition rate. So just bear that in mind. Uh, but it works pretty well with all the well-known songs. And of course the quality of song matters, uh, so you can't be like uh, 500 meters away or something on the festival, maybe that that in that occasion app won't work. Also if there is a, a bit of a remix of the song, maybe it also won't work. So this app is really good if you have some well-known hit or something like that and you just uh, play that and then this app recognizes instantly. Um, 
well maybe it, even that it can take some time actually there is a cool show which is called beat shazam it's streamed on a fox tv i guess and the idea of that show is that you need to be faster than the people who recognize the songs uh, on shazam so yeah uh, and if you open shazam app when this show is live streaming so it's streaming on fox tv or something um, then uh, you can just uh, try to listen to the song with this app and try to guess faster the artist than the app if you do that uh, then yeah then you can eventually even win some prizes so that also cool experience if you like shazamin so anyways uh, hope this quick preview was helpful thanks for watching like and subscribe visit my website mrhagler.io